The question is simplify cot inverse square root of 1 plus x square minus x. Since it is square root of 1 plus x square, if you put x as tan theta, then 1 plus tan square theta is x square theta. So, put x equal to tan theta. Therefore, the question becomes square root of 1 plus tan square theta minus tan theta. And you know, 1 plus tan square theta is x square theta. So that the question becomes cot inverse sec theta minus tan theta. Now convert sec theta as 1 by cos theta and tan theta as sin theta by cos theta. So after subtracting you can write 1 minus sin theta by cos theta. The numerator is 1 minus sin theta. You can write 1 minus sin theta as for 1 you can write cos square theta by 2 plus sin square theta by 2. And for sin theta, you can write 2 cos theta by 2 into sin theta by 2. So, by the algebra identity a square plus b square minus 2ab, it can be written as a minus b whole square. Therefore, the numerator 1 minus sin theta can be rewritten as cos theta by 2 minus sin theta by 2 whole square. And the denominator is cos theta. If you uh, apply the identity cos 2 theta equal to cos square theta minus sin square theta. So, cos theta can be written as cos square theta by 2 minus sin square theta by 2. So, now the numerator is cos theta by 2 minus sin theta by 2 whole square and the denominator is cos theta by 2 minus sin, th sin theta by 2 bracket cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2 by using the algebra a square minus b square is a plus b bracket a minus b. So, uh, one thing is cancelled out because cos theta by 2 sin theta minus sin theta by 2 is cancelled out from the numerator and denominator. So, the end product is cot inverse bracket cos theta by 2 minus sin theta by 2 by cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2. If you dividing throughout by sin theta by 2 it will look like this. So, that it become cot inverse cot theta by 2 minus 1 by cot theta by 2 plus 1. I am intentionally multiplying 1 in the numerator cot theta by 2 because for 1 I can write cot pi by 4. So, that finally it can be written as cot theta by 2 into cot pi by 4 minus 1 by cot theta by 2 plus that one write it as cot pi by 4 and uh, we have an identity cot theta by cot a into cot b minus 1 by cot a plus cot b is cot a plus b so that it can be written as cot it was cot theta by 2 plus pi by 4 so this is finally become theta by 2 plus pi by 4 and for theta you can write tan inverse x Final answer is half tan inverse x plus pi of 4.